This is sort of a culmination of the last three weeks. We've been incredibly busy and yeah, we've moved into our new apartment. And so I haven't vlogged that much, but I'm going to try and make sense of all this footage. We're starting with a few weeks ago, Brandon and I took a little trip to Ikea. We had a very specific reason as to why we were going, and that was to look at the mattresses because we all needed new mattresses. These guys were outside and they were tuning up their instruments. It was really cool. Ikea is the same everywhere. I just would like to point that out. There are a few differences, but yeah, it's Ikea. So it was, it's kind of comforting in a way. We ended up buying pillows, which I love my new pillow. The next day or a few days later, I don't even know you guys, I'm really sorry, but I was finishing up a fantasy novel and going to some appointments. First I went to the 56th floor all the way up to the UP clinic and had my physical therapy. My fit. It's a little too warm for this though today, honestly. Um, we're short, so I'm glad, but this jacket is like, it's warm, so. Yeah, it was starting to get really warm that day. It was like the first warm day. I love the view. From the up clinic it's so beautiful if you've seen in a previous video of mine I talked about my iron deficiency and so on this day I had to go and refill my prescription at the hospital they're very efficient there After this, I decided to treat myself and went over to the foreign language bookstore. It was a nice little walk. I really, just a beautiful day. This is actually a bus tour we're gonna take this summer and I will make sure to bring you along with me. So on this day, I actually realized I don't think I'm allowed to film in here. And so I was kind of trying to be a little sneaky about it, <laughs> but I was on the mission for this one particular book and I'm going to talk to you about it in another video because I found it. And then I came home and this was here. So I came home to this outside my door. <laughs> this is our new um, mattresses from Ikea. I also got new pillows for all of us because I didn't want to bring old pillows. I don't know. Just new pillows sounded good. But anyway, yay! We have mattresses for the new apartment. On how I like to talk to the camera. I'm like really bad at talking to the camera sometimes, you guys. Like really bad. Anyway, uh, hi, it's Friday. I can't believe I'm actually saying that. I'm getting ready to work out. 
Um, we got some good news. We actually are getting the keys to our new apartment tomorrow. So I thought I was going to have this vlog out like today, but instead of that happening, uh, I'm going to wait. <clears throat> I'm going to record some tomorrow and then I'll put it out next week. I think like by Monday or something, maybe not really sure. We'll see what happens. <laughs> um, but yeah, as you can see, like I'm right by a window right now and like, it's so dark in my downstairs area. I guess you could, this would probably have been a better option to like do this, right? <laughs> it's just, it's so dark. We're so excited to be getting a new apartment that's full of light and it's gonna be so nice. So anyway, I'm gonna be doing that tomorrow and <clears throat> taking you along with me. I have no idea what this sounds like because now my earbuds just connected to the phone. So, yeah. We actually bought a cart at Costco and this is how we moved to our new apartment. It was every day we would just take loads, a couple loads over. And this was our first load, was our mattresses and new pillows. We haven't officially moved in yet, but we're cleaning and putting our mattresses in and we got a refrigerator. Really exciting. So it's really embarrassing, but I actually purchased the wrong size mattress for the kids. <laughs> I was supposed to do the 90 centimeters and I did 80. Uh, so. Yeah, here in a second you hear Holland say, it's really skinny. Well, that's because it's the wrong size. Hello. I'm a smart person. Yeah, it's not that skinny. Having our very first meal in the new apartment. <laughs> Hello, I'm in my new apartment, making coffee, and uh, hi, I've had just a lot going on with moving into this apartment. We're still not even totally done yet. Um, we have no furniture, and that's fun. Trying to put everything away, but not being able to put everything away is really frustrating, because then things are just like lined up everywhere. So. What happened was the old apartment, we had um, furniture. Furniture was like provided in the apartment. And so moving here, we got a really nice apartment, but no furniture. So we are going to have to outfit it over the next month or so. Um, and yeah, <laughs> it's gonna be fun. So actually the first day in a week that I'm not moving, I'm actually going downtown to, um, I have an appointment. From there, I'm actually gonna go have lunch with my friend Sabrina. So I'm gonna take you guys with me and we're going to a restaurant called Green Veg. Um, it's a vegan restaurant here in Shanghai and I'm really excited because I haven't been there yet. So I'm gonna drink my coffee while I go get ready. But yeah, see you guys in a little bit.
This was actually a pretty busy week. I had three voiceover gigs this week, and this was the first one. It was for a cell phone company here in China. I had seen this coffee shop a couple of times, um, and I just really wanted to try it out because of the name. It's called Creeper. <laughs> I love it. The coffee was really good, actually. The next day, I was back at it again, and had two jobs this day. My voice was very tired by the end of the day. So I just got out of my job an hour early, and so now I am sitting on the side of the street trying to find a coffee shop to go hang out in for an hour and a half、um, because I can't go all the way back home and then come all the way back out here. So I think that there is an end stand. Which is really good coffee.、Um, that's just like across the street. So I'm gonna go check that out. But yeah, the job ended up being really cool because at first I was a little worried, but、um, because the guy was being like really picky. But then he ended up being awesome, and I just did a ton of takes with each line, and he was like, "Those are great." So ended up only taking an hour instead of the usually like yesterday's job. I went over by half an hour. So. Sometimes they want to edit it like on the spot, and this one they didn't. So, anyways, I'm sitting here. Everyone has their umbrellas out, and I'm like over here. The Westerner going, ah, fake me, son. <laughs> It's so funny.、Um, <laughs> this little boy's looking at me. It's so cute. And I will take you with me to my next job. But let's go get coffee first, okay? I found the M stand and just hung out for about an hour and a half. Ate my lunch and then went to a mobile video game company and worked for about two and a half hours. It was a long day, but it was really cool. I love doing voiceover work for them. I'll actually link the commercials that I've done for that company in the description box below. Brandon and I headed out to get some coffee and to try out Pete's. If you're in the United States, you're probably very familiar with this company, and we have one right next to our new apartment. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this kind of random vlog, but we are really enjoying our new home, and I can't wait to show you more of it. I'll see you next week.